Well, in just a couple weeks, voters will decide state and local representatives in the primary election. Our Meet the Candidate series is here to help you get to know the people on the ballot. And this morning, we're joined by Democrat Phil Giaquina, running for District 80. Good morning. Good to morning. have you. Thank you. So we, we were talking about these. We like to do these because it gets you, you know, off the kind of campaign trail and we get to learn about you personally. But you've been around for a while in our community and, and people know you. So let's talk about what you do in our community, Phil. Well, um, as you said, I've been around. Um, uh, my parents uh, taught me and my brothers and sisters to uh, make sure you give back to the community. Mm -hmm. So uh, whether it's uh, volunteer efforts, uh, uh, through study connection, uh, my time on the board of Community Harvest Food Bank, mm -hmm. um, currently uh, serving on uh, Bright Point, which is formerly of Cani, and uh, and I'm a trustee at the Memorial Coliseum. So, uh, and the top of it all off, I'm the uh, state representative for District 80. So mm -hmm. very busy, but yeah. uh, I think it's important that uh, whether whether it's an official board member or just volunteer work, that we all give back to the community in some way. Yeah, I agree. So you know, you talked about your parents um, growing up. Is this something you always aspired to do, or did it kind of just fall into your lap? Yeah, you know, um, I, I think it's all kind of the bigger picture of community service, mm -hmm. and. Um, uh, my brother was on Fort Wayne City Council. My uh, my dad was in the state legislature, and and so I think you learn um, through what, what what they did, and and you just kind of gain that that interest. Um, and uh, certainly, I, I then decided to run for the uh, for the office, and um, uh, and have, have enjoyed it. And again, I think it's all about doing great things for the city of Fort Wayne, and, and watching the city grow. It's been really a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. So when you're not working and <laughs> not busy. During your free time, what do you like to do? Well, I tell you what. After if you have uh, any, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's a good good question. Um, there are so many fun things to do now in Fort Wayne. Oh, yeah. it, it, it's really great, uh, and I'm glad the summer weather is here with the tin caps uh, mm -hmm. uh, starting up and and uh, playing playing golf over at Foster Park. I like to do that. Uh, taking walks around the park. It's really fun. Um, uh, just being outside and enjoying all the different festivals that are going to be coming starting uh, this weekend, I think, yeah. at Headwater. So there's just really so much to do, and and uh, I've, I've talked to so many people that say, man, there's a lot of fun things to do in Fort Wayne, so yeah. if you can't find something to do. I'm not sure whose fault that is. Right? Yeah, you might not be looking in the right spot. Yeah. You said you were. You joked that you were just having mimosas in the back with our previous <laughs> guest. <laughs> Jeez, I told her I better wait till after I'm done. Yeah, with me too. <laughs> um, I want to touch on the fact that you. We didn't do this with you last time because you didn't have an opponent. Now you do. So how are you feeling? Uh, going into this with uh, against Linda Brooks. Oh yeah, I'm feeling pretty good. I mean, um, we I've certainly been out talking to folks, uh, knocking on doors, attending events, um, and really just running on my record and the things I've done for uh, for the 80th district and and for the city as a whole. Um, uh, I feel like I, as a, an experienced legislator, gained a lot of. Um, knowledge of how things are done. I've used that experience to get legislation passed. And um, so, running on my record, I had great responses at the doors and um, feel very good thing about things. Okay, well, you're a busy person, so thanks for coming in and for making me. time for us today. We appreciate much. it. Phil Giaquina is on the Democratic ticket. His opponent is Linda Brooks. See this interview again later today on Wayne.com. We'll be right back.